Hey guys, or guys and gals, girls, ladies, men and women. Kept you early, Pure Focus Sports Club, president of the AMBF, the American Natural Bodybuilding Federation. We're really, uh, you talk about being on a roll, AMBF is on a roll big time, but that's not, I, I mean, I, I want to do another video about our show from last weekend when Chris Jones came up, so I'll, I'll do that. I'm going to start doing videos on YouTube again. I realize the importance of getting it out there. Not everybody's on Facebook, not everybody's on Instagram, not everybody's on Twitter. But if I go on to YouTube, then maybe I can hit more people and, and spread the word, spread you know, natural bodybuilding for us, the AMBF, I mean, for the other organizations too, there's new shows popping up everywhere. So I want to get the information out. I want to do, I, I want to help you guys out. I want to show you some stuff. I want to give you motivation. I want to, I want to get you pumped up because we all need a little motivation. And if I could help you guys get through the day, through your workouts and motivate you and push you, this 52 year old body is not done yet. My plans for competing this year, you know, so some people have been asking me, uh, you know, it's, I don't really... I haven't really put it out there, but I've had a, my schedule just has made it impossible for me to concentrate. Not just my schedule, but I had I had some other issues with my I, with my eyes and colon and stuff. It's just minor stuff that just conglomerated into being a big pain in the ass. And then with all the travel with the AMBF, which is really a big time priority for me, is really getting the AMBF out there, going to every single show, traveling 23 weekends of the year, plus going to other shows and helping judging out not just AMBF shows, but for uh, NGA shows, try to try to head judge and MC an OCB show, and uh, two weeks before I was given the kibosh. Kind of strange. I'm willing to help out, volunteer my time uh, because I was invited and asked, and then I was declined because I wasn't good enough for that organization. Um, that's a whole nother story. But I, you know, I'm willing to go anywhere. So if anybody out there needs an MC, needs a head judge, I can guarantee you, I will create the most entertaining environment that you've probably ever had at your shows. I love doing that. I love. First thing I do, I go to I go to judge a show yesterday down in Fredericksburg for Medina Roberts. First thing I did, I said, "Where's the pump up room? I'm gonna go talk to people." I'm in the back talking to people, some new friends, old friends, people that I don't recognize because they're 20 pounds lighter than the last time I saw them. But. I want to be out there. I want to be, I want to mingle. I want to be with the people. I'm not, you know, I, I'm not about just, I want to go to the people. That's what I'm there for. I'm there to, to motivate people, to, to educate people, to, to push them to hit their goals. Whether I'm training a 60 year old housewife or I'm training a bikini girl who wants to be the next AMBF pro or a IFPA pro or NPC nationals competitor. That's another video. But I just want to get out there and have a good time. And I'll go anywhere. So if anybody needs an MC or a head judge, uh, just contact me. KRB46 at Comcast.net. Well, the reason I'm for this video is I did legs tonight with my son, Joseph. I wonder how old you have to be until you don't, you're don't. you not called Joey anymore and then people call you Joseph. Because he's 21 years old, I still have to call him Joey. Joey. So we had a good leg workout. I, I, again, I'm, I'm, I'm trying to get myself used to the fact that I'm not in contest prep, so I really need to start kind of changing the focus of my workout. So I'm trying to start going heavy again, and it, it is amazing because the weights, light weights from back beginning of the year feel heavy as shit, and it's amazing. My knees, my hips, my back, they're not, you're just not used to holding that weight. So, of course, my son wanted to do legs, and the biggest motivation that anybody can have is their youngest – well, their younger son, obviously he's younger because I'm his father, but your son, who's 21 years old, challenging you to do legs. He challenging me to do legs, that little bastard. So, of course, I wouldn't let him um, beat me. So I had to do more than him, even though I know probably physically I shouldn't be doing that much. But you know what? I never back down to a challenge. So, Joe, nice try. I beat you again. But there may be a day coming soon Well, I will not. So I'm trying to put the video together just piece by piece. Hopefully it works because I really don't know what the hell I'm doing with this whole YouTube and iMovie and all this other stuff. So we did squats. Well, we started with leg press. We did squats. We did sissy squats. Then we did leg extensions. And that was the, that was our workout. We had a good time. The gym is packed. Uh, we got on the squat. We At Pure Focus, it's not National Chest Day on Mondays. It is squat day. We had five squat racks all going across the back of the gym, which is awesome. Love to see that, people deadlifting. 
We got women doing their workout. We got all sorts of stuff going on here at Pure Focus. So if you're in the area, please come to Pure Focus Sports Club and check us out. You will not be disappointed with the gym, the environment, and the people that work here and the people that train here. We have one kick-ass gym that I, I'm sorry that the rest of the country cannot come and be here and work out. We are a no BS gym. We are the true no judgment zone. Because we take it, we're like the Statue of Liberty. I'll take, I'll take your weak, your meager, your whatever. I'll take you all, and you'll love my gym. So come check us out. Again, this is Kent Burley from Pure Focus Sports Club, the president of the AMBF. I will be in Myrtle Beach this weekend. They're going to be all dried out for us. They're cleaning everything up down there just for the AMBF to make its way. The crazy train's got to make its way to Myrtle Beach. So we got to get rid of all that water. Hopefully everybody down there is safe. And I hope everybody going to the show will be safe. It's, um, it's bad. You know, water is a bad thing. It can be very powerful, very beautiful, but very powerful. Just imagine a gallon of water weighs eight pounds. So imagine that ocean and all that water coming from the mountains, just washing stuff away. So everybody, please be careful down there. And whoever is coming to Myrtle Beach, the show is on. We will be there. We will have a one kick-ass show. We can't wait. We had a great time last year. We can't wait to come back. So, this is Kent Beerley. I hope you enjoy the video. I'm going to make more videos, so be on the lookout for more videos. Thanks. Stay focused. You're lower than that. <laughs> it's my, <laughs> my son Joey. Say hello, Joe. Hello. It's mini me. We just did our leg workout. You guys just saw, um, I'm at, where are you going? I want some away. Gotta be in the video. Get over here. It's my son Joey. Say hello, Joe. Hello. A lot of you guys have met him at different shows and all over the place and pictures of him when he was one years old and stuff. We just did our leg workout. I hope you guys liked it. We're, just in, we're, we're actually trying to be more modern and do like a video of our workouts instead of just workout of the day, right, Joe? Right. So, you know, everybody needs motivation to work out and stuff like that. So I tell you a little story. When I was younger, when he was younger, I coached the Pop Warner football team, and I used to do. Where are you going? I'm not done yet. And we used to do sprints, and the coaches, coaches, and the players used to ask me, "Well, when are you going to stop sprinting with the kids?" I said, "Well." when they catch me. So here I am. Jordan, come here. Oh my so here Jordan. I am. Jordan, help. Jordan. <laughs> help, Jordan. So and my daughter just walked in. Everybody's afraid of the camera. Why is everybody afraid of the camera? So now my son asked me, Dad, you want to do legs? 
Meanwhile, I was going through a little contest prep. You know, you guys know the whole story. My year's all screwed up, so I'm not doing contest prep, but I haven't really been doing heavy squats. So he says, okay, we're going to do legs. And I'm like, oh, jeez. Come on. Come on, Jordan. All right, Jordan doesn't want to be in the video. So I'll keep doing squats with my son until he can squat more than me. Okay, I did. No, you did not. Did you? Do the same. Well, he didn't do more than me. I'm just working. I told him in a couple weeks I'll be back up to the 400s and get up my 500. So, can you do that? Yeah. He says he's gonna do 405 soon, right? Yep. Yeah. Sit. Yeah, yeah. All right. So, for those of you that are watching, my 80 viewers, um, the Myrtle Beach show is on next Saturday. I've talked to the school. Flooding's going away. Thank goodness in that area. Hopefully everybody's safe. So if you're going there, please drive safely. The weather's supposed to be nice towards the end of the week, so we'll get it nice and dried out. So this is Kent Beerley, president of the ANBF, and the prince, right. what? Okay. The prince, the heir to the throne of whatever I got left, Joey Beerley, saying goodbye from Pure Focus Sports Club. Say goodbye, Joe. See you later. Good job, Joe. You got a career in TV. Okay.